Okay, we're gonna change the window on this car. It's kind of cracked up, so we're got a little, little turkey baster here. We're right, looking for a spray bottle, but we need to squirt a little bit of water on the rubber on the inside, and then we'll use the tool and we'll um, take the window out. It's quick and easy. I'll just squirt some water down here. What do we need the water for? The water is to make the the blade so it doesn't stick in the rubber. So just get the little tool here. And away we go. It's got a tapered side on it. Maybe some metal stuff in there. I should have a look. Rubber up the other side. Okay, good enough. Just let it go there. Set it on the roof. Okay, this rubber around here is cut off close to the glass, so we're going to take most of this off and just leave a skim of rubber on the metal. And we'll put the new uh, urethane on top of that, and it'll hold the window in nicely and seal it up nicely. Okay, we just take our knife and just take a skim of it off. Well, like that, all the way around, and we'll be done. Okay, we're going to patch this corner here. You can see where the rust wasn't making contact around here that was leaking right in this area so we're gonna get some just put some bondo and clean this up and put some bondo on it and it should be a good So here's a neat little trick. This is a front windshield of the car. This is a piece of ceramic from a spark plug. 
And ceramic is one of the hardest things around. And this is just a little rock about, I don't know, three times the size of the piece of ceramic. If I throw this rock at the window, it most likely won't break. But I throw this ceramic at it, this little light, light piece of ceramic, it'll probably put a nice big crack in the window. Actually, if you use this on your side window or keep a piece in your car, you could throw it at your side window and it would shatter it and let you out of the car. But here, let's give it a shot. First, the rock. A rock broke into pieces. <laughs> Didn't even leave a scratch in the window. Now, I'll try the ceramic. Let's see what happens. There's a mark left by the ceramic pieces of spark plug. Before you put your window on, you want to use a stuff called pinch weld. And it helps the urethane seal the window to the car. And it comes with this little foamy brush. And all you do is you dip it in a can and you rub it along the places where there's no rubber or just bare glass so so you just kind of rub it along the window here if there's just bare glass showing or around the, the frame of the of the car where the window sits um, where there's bare metal um, where the window will touch just want to make sure you put this pinch weld stuff on it and then you wait 10 minutes before you put the urethane around the seal Okay. Now how long? Well, we can spray water on it. It, it will uh, work a little faster. For whoops, maybe about four hours. So that takes me you know, four hours. Just okay. Making sure that it's touching all the way along. Right. The window is placed and the urethane's in. You can see some of it squishing out. Yeah, it's not quite the right windshield, huh? It's, it's a little bit, bit short at yeah. the bottom. Auto record job, eh? Yeah, we got this one from the auto records, but it'll work perfectly. Now, four hours for the urethane to dry, but if you mist water on it, um, apparently it dries a lot quicker. Looking good. Looking good. <laughs> 